Hello everybody, this is Shamla Parthasarthi. Today is the ninth day of Navaratri. I am going to show you all how to prepare broken wheat pongal, poha paisam and kuttukadale or black chickpeas. So first let us see how to prepare broken wheat pongal. I have taken here one glass of broken wheat. In the same glass measurement I have taken quarter glass of moong dal, curry leaves, two green chilies slit, half a tablespoon of ginger, half a teaspoon of cashew nut, half a teaspoon of mustard, half a teaspoon of pepper, half a teaspoon of jeera. Now first what you have to do is we have to fry broken wheat and moong dal separately. I have already done it. And now we'll, we are going to wash it and keep it in the cooker. Yes, I have finished washing. To this, I am going to add 3 glasses of water. Little quarter teaspoon of turmeric powder. Salt to taste. Now I am going to keep this in cooker. I will keep it for 3 whistles. Yes, now I am keep, keep, keeping it in cooker. For three whistles, I have to keep it. Yes, by the time this broken wheat pongal gets ready, let us see for the next recipe that is the poha paisam. Here I have taken half a cup of thick poha, half a cup of powdered jaggery, half a cup of water. Here, cashew nut, I have taken one tablespoon. Raisins, 1 tablespoon, ghee to fry and cardamom, quarter teaspoon. Here I have taken 2 and a half glass of milk. Now first what you are going to do is, you have to fry poha which I have already fried and kept it ready. You have to wash it, drain the water and then we have to cook it. Yes, I have washed poha at the same time I have taken out the jaggery syrup also. Now I put the pan here. I put the ghee also. I put one tablespoon of ghee. To this I am going to add cashew nut and raisins. So that once it gets fried we will remove it. It should come to golden color. And we will be removing it. Yes. I remove the raisin and the cashew nut. In the same pan. In the leftover. The, we are going to dry fry again. Because we have washed this over. Slightly we will fry. And add milk. slightly then slowly add the milk this poha should get cooked now here I have transferred the from the pan to the vessel here the poha is getting cooked in milk and my cooker where I have kept the broken beef for this is getting ready in the last I Now here I am going to show you all simultaneously how to prepare chickpea. Now the ingredient that is required for the chickpea we have already done this but it will be in a different method. Here I have taken here I have taken the sundel that is the chickpea one glass of chickpea, one small glass of chickpea which I have cooked and kept it ready. Half a teaspoon of urud dal, half a teaspoon of mustard, one finely into, I have done into small pieces, one red chilli, half a teaspoon of ginger and the masala which I fried and showed you all in the video there last time. So and hing salt to taste 
Now, once the pan gets hot, I'll put the oil. Yes, here my poha has got cooked. I'm adding the jaggery syrup here along with cardamom. Mix it. Let it boil. Later, we will do it. We'll, we'll be doing only the seasoning. Just let it boil for a few minutes. Now here, the pan is ready. Here I put the oil. The oil has also become hot. To this, I am going to add mustard, urud dal, chilli, ginger, little curry pata, fry, and then add hing to it. Fry, cook chickpeas, cook cook the caramel, fry it, salt to taste, and finally your masala powder. Fry. I have not added coconut. Grated coconut. If you want, you can add the grated coconut. Today I am not adding it. Check the details. Everything that how I have put this in second day of Navratri. What I have done. And on the first day, I had shown you all how to prepare this masala. Yes, your poha also is ready, poha parsley. I'll add this cashew nut and raisins to it. Your sundar also is ready, poha is ready. Now, I have to wait for the steam to come down for this broken wheat to be seasoned. Yes. Your broken wheat pongal is ready. Now we will have to season it. Here I put a pan. To this I am going to add 3 tablespoons of ghee. As once it gets hot, I will add mustard. It's spluttering, cashew nut, pepper, jeera, cashew nut should become light brown in color. Ginger. Fry, chili, slip chili, two slip chili, and finally curry pata. This curry pata I have already washed and kept it for drying. So that is which I have added here directly. Now it's over. We will garnish this on this pongal. The pongal is ready. We will mix it up. Yes, your pongal, broken with pongal is ready. Yes, now your poha payasam. Broken wheat, pongal and chickpeas, sundel or kotukarle sundel is ready to be served. If you like this video, like it, share it and don't forget to subscribe. I will see you all in the next video with a new recipe. Bye for now.